everyone, in today's video I'm going to be doing a review and demo of the Remington flat iron with vapor infused technology. It says that it can rehydrate, protect, and strain your hair in one pass. This video is a sponsored video and I was sent this iron to test the key features that include instant high heat within 30 seconds, digital precise heat, a swivel cord, and a snag free glide. I will also be doing a demo in this product, so let's get started. My first task is to fill the reservoir with distilled water. It's extremely important that you use distilled water because if you use any other type of water, it will have microscopic minerals that will damage the internal parts of your strainer and you'll probably have to buy a new straightener. Simply remove the reservoir. Now you're going to twist off the top and fill it with distilled water. Make sure you do it over sink because I did have some spillage. I picked up the distilled water from a local Publix here in the area and there's only one way to put back the reservoir so make sure the wick is facing up towards the ceramic plates. To test the instant high heat feature, Remington claims that the straightener will heat up in 30 seconds. So let's give it a go. I'm going to use my phone as a timer and it does make 30 second mark. The next product feature is the digital precise heat from 300 degrees Fahrenheit to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. When you turn on the straightener, initially you're going to see two red dots light up. Each dot represents a temperature setting. One dot means that the temperature is at 300 degrees after 30 seconds. Two dots means that the temperature is at 340 degrees Fahrenheit. Three dots, 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Four dots, 410 degrees Fahrenheit. And five red dots means 450 degrees Fahrenheit. I would say I have very thick hair, but my hair is pretty healthy and normal. So I'm going to straighten my hair at the third red dot at 375 degrees Fahrenheit. And I'm going to press the blue button to activate the vapor feature. Now I'm going to divide my hair into sections and start straightening. It's recommended that if you have very fine hair or fragile hair, you should use the temperature between 300 and 340 degrees Fahrenheit. If you have normal hair, and it straightens easily, use 370 degrees Fahrenheit. And if you have extremely difficult hair to straighten or thick hair, use 410 degrees to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, as I'm straightening, I, I could visually steam coming out of the straightener. I didn't notice any burning smells that I normally smell with my Paul Mitchell straightener. Yet, my hair was extremely straight and soft to the touch. So here is what my hair looks like in a before and after comparison. And if you guys have any questions about this product, definitely leave them down below and I'll make sure to answer them. And when this product comes out in spring of 2015, I'll place a link down below in the description. If you would like to see more videos like this, make sure to leave this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next video.